Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mond and today we will learn and solve chapter 15, exercise 15a, questions 1 to 10, exercise 15a, chapter 15, chapter name is perimeter and area of class 6 of composite mathematics textbook. If you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. And please visit my blog mesclear.com for more information regarding the textbook solution of CBSE, ICSE and other states board. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve exercise 15a chapter 15 questions 1 to 10. Chapter name is perimeter and area. Let's solve some questions. Now we solve question number 5. Rectangular piece of land measures 0.7 km by 0.5 km. Each side is to be fenced with 4 rounds of wire. What length of wire is needed? This is a rectangular piece of land. Rectangular, rectangular land. And this length is 0.7 meter. 7 km. And breadth is 0.5 km. And each side, that is length and breadth sides, is to be fenced with 4 rounds of wire. This breadth side is fenced with 4 rounds. 4 rounds of wire. That is, you have to multiply with 4. That will be the side of that rectangular piece of land. So, it will be 2.0 km and this length each side so the length also hence with 4 rounds of wire so it will also be multiplied with 4 so it will be 2.8 km and we know opposite sides of the rectangle rectangle is equal so this is also 2.8 meter length and this breadth is also 2.0 meter kilometer now we have to find out what length of wire is needed that is perimeter this length means perimeter of this rectangular piece of land we have to find out so perimeter of rectangular piece of land is 2 multiplied with length plus breadth that is 2 multiplied with length is 2.8 km and breadth is 2.0 km that is 2 multiplied with 4.8 km which is equal to 9.6 km so length of the wire is 9.6 km So length of the wire needed is 9.6 km. This is the answer. Now we solve question number 6. A rectangular field is 72 meter by 58 meter. Omar works 
अमर वर्क्स राउंड इन एट द रेट ऑफ थ्री किलोमीटर पर आवर व्हाट टाइम विल ही टेक इन टेकिंग टू राउंड दिस इज रेक्टेंगुलर फील्ड हैविंग लेंथ सेवेंटी टू मीटर ऑपोजिट साइड्स आर इक्वल सो इट विल बी सेवेंटी टू मीटर एंड ब्रेड इज फिफ्टी एट मीटर सो इट विल ऑल्सो बी फिफ्टी एट मीटर ऑपोजिट साइड्स आर इक्वल इन रेक्टेंगुलर Omar walks round it at the rate of three kilometer per hour. What time will he take in taking two rounds? First, we have to find out the distance covered by Omar in one round. That is the perimeter of the rectangular field. So, distance covered in one round. That is. The perimeter of him to multiply with length plus breadth. To multiply with seventy-two meter. Plus fifty-eight meter. Seventy-two plus fifty-eight is one hundred thirty meter. And two multiplied with one hundred thirty meter is two hundred sixty meter. So distance covered in one round is two hundred sixty meter. But uh, Amar works. Now, Amar takes two rounds, so we have to find out distance covered in two rounds. That is, we have to multiply two with two hundred sixty meter. The distance covered in two round. It will be two multiplied with two hundred sixty meter. In one round, distance covered in one round is two hundred sixty meter. So, um, Amar takes two round. Two round. So we have to find out distance covered in two round. That is, we have to multiply two with two hundred sixty meter. That is five hundred twenty meter. So distance covered in two rounds is 520 meter. Now Omar walks round it at the rate of three kilometer per hour. He walks in 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 one hour three kilometer. So Omar walks three kilometer in in one hour. So Omar walks in three kilometer will be. In one hour, it will be three multiplied by one thousand because the distance covered in two rounds is five hundred twenty meter. So we have to convert this kilometer into meter. So we have to multiply three with one thousand meter. That is three thousand meter. So Amar works three kilometer is three thousand meter. That is in one hour, three thousand one three thousand meter in one hour. In one hour, 
Q of 3 km that is 3000 meter. Now we have to find out um, Omar walks in in one hour he, he walks 3000 meter in in one hour he walks 3000 meter so 5000 3000 meter he walks in 1 hour so 5000 meter 520 meters 520 meters in 1 divided by 1 3000 multiplied with 520 meter 3000 meter he works 3000 meter in 1 hour so in 1 meter he will work 1 divided by 3000 so 520 meter he works 520 meter will be 1 divided by 3000 multiplied with 520 meter now 52 divided by 300 that is 3 52 divided by 300 26 226 ja 52 50 then 13 75 ja 135 ja 150 now 13 by 75 13 by 75 multiply with 10. Our, we have to multiply our convert hour into minute. He walks 3000 meter in one hour. So in one minute, one meter he will he will work 1 divided by 3000 then in the perimeter is uh, we get uh, we got perimeter is 520 meter so in 520 meter he will work 1 divided by 3000 multiply with 300 multiply with 520 meter now we have to convert this 13 divided by 75 13 divided by 75 hour into multi, hour into minute so multiply with 60 that is the minute we have to convert this hour into minute so multiply with 60 so now 15 15 5 ja 75 15 4 ja 60 52 divided by 5 minute that is 5 tenja um, 5 tenja 50 2 divided by 5 minute it will be 10 minute By five. Hmm. Ten minutes. 
plus 2 by 5 minute will be 2 by 5 minute. Minute means into 60 second. We have to multiply with 60 that is 12. So 10 minute. 10 minute plus 24 second that is 10 minute 24 second So, Omar will take ten minutes, twenty four seconds in two rounds. This is the answer. If you have not subscribed my YouTube channel, then please subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you have any doubt, then please write in comment section and I will reply. Keep learning, keep watching, and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you. If you like this video then please click the like button and share this. If you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. If you have any doubts then please write in comment section and I will reply. Keep learning, keep watching and thanks for watching. Please subscribe my youtube channel.